Okay, so this is going to be a melee berserk sorceress using the passion rune ward. So all she gets is two passion rune words and otherwise she just gone melee. Evil beware. She just gonna be a wacka dude. Courtesy of Ditch Boy. So the skills, let's see. Where's the full rule, rules again? Did you send it to me on Discord? All right. I can have... Hi, YouTube. Hi, Juggling. Uh, Berserk, Energy Shield, Sorceress. Grandfather in as many Passion Swords as you need. Um, as long as the primary attack is Berserk and you look towards Max and Energy Shield, I think uh, you can do whatever else. Enchant, Static, Field, Teleport... Low level Frost Nova are all fair game. Leveling up to Passion, think Melee Source. Um, yeah, there you go. So, we'll uh, give it a try, see how it goes. Little melee source action, always some fun. We can have a mercenary, so we'll definitely be rocking some enchant um, for ourselves and for our mercenary. And the way it'll work with Berserk is Berserk converts the physical damage over, Ooh. so we'll Make actually be physical and, and fire because it won't convert work. the enchant over. Thank you, Vino. Just as a note. Level me. Nice. Feral, thank you as well. Appreciate that. <laughs> Enchant Act 1 Firebow Mercenary. Oh, we'll go get ourselves a fire merc Firebow Mercenary for show. Now, Enchant is a ways away. That is the only... Uh, Annoyance, you know. Man, part of me wants to get like a scepter or something to smack some dudes with, but. Let's see. Where do we want our first skill to go? Warmth seems kind of pointless. I guess frozen armor. This place is trouble. Oops. Sorry. I didn't hit anything. Static is allowed. Max ES. We'll definitely be pushing ES. I mean, you, you want to put points in telekinesis. So. Yeah. Like I say, I think, I think it'll be enchant energy shield is going to be the build. Sounds rough. I guess we should put rules up for the build. Um, static Frost Nova cheating? No. Um, so this is rules. One melee until uh, free. Passion given to source to melee until uh, melee whole game. Three enchant um, static, etc. Okay, these are pretty bad rules. Merce allowed. 
five. I'm just zero. We'll just go make a rule zero. Berserk. And what up, CJ? Plus energy shield focus. There we go. Thanks, Papa. Something like that. We're doing that. Recent guy in the fire druid hydra sort. I th I'm pretty sure I have. Oh, the written playthrough part of it. Um. I, I only had those for the like fastest ways for leveling, I believe. But maybe those are something I'll build in over time. Not opposed to it. So many shamans! to deal with the new lobbies. Blizzard said they're fixing lobbies. That's all we that's all we know though. Man, do I have to actually go into like dexterity on this build? Give me a mess. So it's squishy sounding. Uh, worth using? Yeah, we could try using them, but probably too expensive overall. I would love Blood Fist. Oh my god. Blood Fist would be amazing here. Seriously, what's with all these shamans? I'm falling, man. Crazy. Yeah. Not the D2R1, but I've played it on D2. Is it Players 1 or Players X, Stitch Boy? Honestly, I don't know if I'll ever go above Players 1, though. Maybe when I'm just farming, like, Act 5 Eldritch. Many times I will. But we'll, we'll see how it goes. With enchant doesn't sound challenging. Disagree. One monster left. Come on, man. Is that it? Right there. Tucked into his little corner. Classic. Ugh, pretty meh drops there. Let's just do that. Not much gold. No. Two skill points remaining. Thank you, cut spawn. Uh, I mean, mana is pretty pointless. This is tough, man. This is gonna be a tough start. 
Act 6 with Moogirl. We'll do Act 5 and 6 later. Well, Passion can't be used until level 43, so it'll be a while till we can use Passion. But... How I feel about Immortal? I didn't like it. It's my official statement. Boo! Thanatos Strive gifted a tier 1 sub to Joskin 111. Thanks, Thanatos! I guess let's go with some dexterity. Get that attack rating up. What am I doing in the cave? Eh, it's gonna go level a little bit, but now I'm also debating not because it's cold enchant archers. So, probably not worth it. Oh, overall story and its synergy with the rest of the series? Oh, I don't, I don't pay attention to lore. Though I will say today was my personal hell. I've always, you always kind of wonder like what your personal hell would be like, you know? And today I had a little girl come over. That sounds weird. Uh, Moo Girl's sister and her kids came over and one of her kids wanted to play a game on the computer and I was like okay and she sat there and wouldn't let me touch the keyboard and would go through every line of lore in the game and make me read it and until I read it, she wouldn't move on to the next line. So she'd just push the space bar and it'd be like, Oh no, I can't believe you've come all the way out here. Click. Like. And I was like, just get to the gameplay! Just push the buttons! Yeah, it's, Uncle Alex, what does this say? I don't care, just, just hit space, just jam through it all. So, I was like, I found hell. I have found my version of hell. Now, I mean, you know what lore is really good? Llama RPG lore. How much for that challenge? Way too much. Also, it'd be impossible to get her to sit still through that <laughs> through a, a long session. You're skipping the lore in Llama RPG? Why would you skip the lore? It's such good lore! Looks like Frost Nova is going to be huge early game then. Yep. And static. One more hit! Thank you. No, the lore in Lam RPG is gonna be fantastic. Ponosaur, thank you. I'll put that to good use. I can't use this yet. I can't use that yet. Really? It's like the simplest little helm. Um okay. I'll put that to good use. There you go, we'll do that for now. Yeah, I'm actually excited about the lore in uh, Lama RPG. So. You better enjoy it, Warren, so help me God. Oh, 
Lore is not my genre. Uh, it's gonna be so good, Raggets. I already told you the lore. Minecraft. Right? Warren's playing Minecraft? Not even paying attention. Thanks, Jim. One sentence worth? No. You're just a chill little llama. You wake up one day walk outside and there is a disturbance in the land the llama land llama alpaca land all the little babies the kriyas have been stolen what after talking with some of the hot single llama mamas mama llamas you decide this is a chance to prove yourself and go help find them. So you journey around to various lands looking for all of the babies. I'm not going to spoil it. And uh, you gain a lot of worldly experience along the way. Because you haven't ventured out of the Shire before. Sorry, I mean the Llama Land before. In search. Of, uh... The babies. That's all I can give you right now. I don't want to spoil too much. Suck it, Rakanishu. She can use one-handed weapons. Just, you know, bam! These stones radiate powerful magic. The caterpillar? I, I don't remember Alice in Wonderland, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, we're making Llama RPG. Nonsense story without a real plot. All right, well that works then. It's referring to from passion. So, yeah, Llama RPG broke ground yesterday for the second time. First Llama RPG was nice, you know, nice little intro. I think the second one is gonna be more advanced. We got we got more good stuff in it. Better story. Actually has a story this time. Better heroes and villains. Combat's improved. All sorts of stuff. It's like a speedrun. Throw equals melee? Can I not throw javelins on a melee source? Will my game be pay to win? Yes. No, it's whole purpose is being built as an anti pay to win game. It's the whole reason we're building it because we're tired of those games. You want loot boxes? Sorry. No loot boxes. Eh, sure, why not? It'll be for PC. 
But it's turn-based combat, so I do think a mobile port actually does make plenty of sense on it. Oh, if you want audio on your game, oh, well, you have to subscribe for that. Okay, that's just... Jesus. What? Blue guitar, thank you! Should have never gone to fight that. Your content is excellent, and you should feel excellent. Aw, oh, thank you. We can't go in there until we're level 6. Actually, let's restart so we can get Rakanisha at least. And hit level 6 on the way. Thank you, Blue Guitar. So, no. It's not... It's gonna be focused around being a fun game, not a monetized game. So a lot of the game will probably just be like, if you want to support it, you can pay to support it, and maybe you get, you know, a little badge or something. You know. Something simple like that. Thought I want to exploit you? I don't. I don't know. Maybe... Yeah, pay for badge kind of game. Badge doesn't do anything. It's just a just a badge. What do you win if you have a badge? Profile just has a badge that says I supported this game or something. I don't know. Okay. Perfect. X, let's see. Will there be a whale badge in Lama RPG? That's actually a cute idea. Alright. Whale badge. Perfect. 99.99? Bro, whale badge is like a thousand dollars. 99.99. Uh, oh, the stunts are down there, right? Let's go strength. Maybe there's different tiers of whale badge. You know. 110,000 dollars for the golden whale badge. Perfect. I mean, if you'll spend it on Diablo Immortal, why not Lama RPG, right? More fun game? In my opinion. Uh, okay, we'll need to actually start diving into this. Oh god. Ow! Ouch! Man, those minions hurt! I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. I'm allowed to cast like that. Nice. Yes! 20 poison damage! Let's go! Oh, where do I want to put it? Thanks, Spartacus! In a helm? Let's go helm. Two to Frost Nova, nice. Oh, that's the jewel I was hoping for. Literally best jewel in the game. First start. Melee. Spartacus with those 500 biddies. 
Streamer loot! It's like that lightning sorceress guided playthrough where we found Shaco. One dollar to help with the funding of Llama RPG. Ah, thank you so much. Means a lot. But yeah, I mean, it'll be a... Uh... It's just gonna be a fun game. That's all I'm aiming to do. The whole point of the game is supposed to just be a game that's built for fun because enough games aren't built for fun. How to get Berserk? Passion. I might do a Kickstarter at some point or something for it. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out budget and everything right now. It seems expensive. Seems like one of those things where the costs already are scaling up and I'm like, well, hold on a second. <laughs> so. But we'll see. We'll see. Kind of like Final Fantasy style? Maybe a little bit, yeah. I'm still trying to decide if I want the combat to be more... It'll probably be look look like Final Fantasy style, side by side, and kind of, you know, your actions below and stuff. I think that's where I'll end up at. <laughs> but yeah at this point what I really need to do is sit down and storyboard because there's so many things like character selection screen starting screen inventory you know like all of these things that are going to need to be built out and so even though I have a lot of the ideas for a lot of the pieces and blah, 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 you know, it's like I need to get all of these things, you know, like written out and figured out so I have just everything. Yeah, because a lot of it's in my head. I have written a lot of stuff down, but even still not in that storyboard way, you know. What does the intro screen look like? Even just, not even what does it look like, but is somebody going to, you know, who's going to create it? And maybe just give them some freedom. Right? This might be stuff where I just look to, to people and be like, hey, whoever wants to make this, just uh, make it. Uh, I believe so, Ace. If it makes that little noise, you'll know. Burr source challenge. Oh, the bear source? Yeah. Bear source is fun. Yeah, and I know Wreckful RIP was making that game and never really came around and spent a lot on it and stuff, which I mean I don't I don't know exactly what all he was trying to do with his game and everything there. But you know, making making games is it seems uh, easy and hard at the same time. It's easy for a lot of the generic stuff, which is why I feel like you get a lot of generic mobile games and things that do get pushed out. But when you really want to add in all the little features and fun things and all that stuff, you know, you really have to do a lot of extra. And there's just so many details. Yeah, it's like it's easy until it's very difficult, it feels like. So. Yeah. And that's where also I think, you know, 
talking to people who have made games and chat before and stuff um, will be really helpful. Yeah, exactly, Mobbin. You know, because if I can sit down and talk to people that have made some games and they can go over and say, hey, something that's going to be a difficulty is this, you know, or you need this, this, and this. This is something a lot of people don't think about. All of that stuff, uh, I think, is really helpful. Yeah. Because, you know, even something like, you know, I was thinking about this yesterday, like inventory systems and stuff. And I'm like, making an inventory system is probably not crazy hard. I mean, I could probably literally just copy paste an inventory system from another game and then adjust the graphics and all of that. However, m the way my inventory system is going to work is going to be a little bit unique. And, oh, I'm sorry, Mobbin. And so I have to, like, think about that. I would love Angelics. And, you know, just think about, like, what's that system going to end up looking like? And then writing the code and changes to all that will start definitely taking some time. And so that'll be, you know stuff that we'll have to deal with and I don't know I, I think there's gonna be a lot of pieces that we run into or they'll they'll be just minor enough changes that it's going to require a good understanding of it all How to fight Duriel. We'll deal with that when we get around to it. We have static, so I guess there you go. Static field is working for us here. Yeah, learning C sharp. It's helpful. So, yeah, I mean, I think my first steps are really just going to be spend like 20, 30, 40 hours just watching a bunch of C sharp and Unity tutorials. And, uh, and then we'll kind of go from there. You know. Well, phase blade's gonna be a little too high, so probably a dimensional blade. Or an, a battle sword, maybe. Yeah, I mean, I know Java, so my understanding of C-sharp is already pretty good. Um, and I've coded with and just lots of I've done lots of coding in my life, so I, I don't feel like I'm not an amazing coder in some ways I feel pretty strong in like Python and stuff. I haven't used Java since college So, you know, I'd take a little bit for that, but I feel like I'm an okay coder um, But learning unity will be a whole thing That'll just take some time so yeah, I mean, I think I'll, I think I'll be able to read and understand the the stuff that I'm coming across, which is the important part to me. Because again, I think a lot of stuff will be pulling from what other um, you know games have already done for a lot of systems, right? I mean, I think that's I imagine there's five billion scripts out there about you know, setting players 
counts or changing gear or whatever, right? Once we get uh, the storyboard and stuff going, I mean, I'd say if you want to be a part of it, send me a message on my Discord. That's probably the best way to get in and then, you know, say what, like, skills you have. Yeah, it'll mostly just be, you know, like I say, I'll probably just look to have different community members kind of just throw together whatever little things. Hey, can somebody, you know, help design the graphic screen or something? Can somebody do this, like. Happy llama, sad llama, mentally disturbed llama, stupid llama, drama llama, big fat mama llama, llama llama llama. Who is this big llama? Uh, Starting all this drama. Yeah. It's me, big. It's me. Am I sure this guy's a professional D2 streamer? He's using melee on a sorceress. Guess I'll have to just keep watching and find out Malama Sork Malama Barb. That's a fair point. Thanks, Bear Trek. Ugh. That's a, yeah, a little cover. Yes, once we get to Passion, we'll be using Berserk for this one. Do you think with the lessons learned from D3, they won't insist on all power coming from... You know, I mean, Diablo 4, I, I, I just don't know. I just don't know. I, I, I do think it has potential. I also think it may go too far. They might start leaning into, like, Lost Ark and do, like, a Diablo 3 Lost Ark combination where it's, like, itemization is kind of iffy and whatever, and you can, like, buy progression and that stuff and, you know... I, I, I do have concerns for sure in how it's going to end up moving there. And, you know, of course the biggest is still how does how does the itemization fall in and stuff? Are you just going to be swinging giant Crit, 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 giant, you know, strength sticks and stuff. No, my helm broke. That's actually so annoying. That was so much of my damage. Should have put it in a better helmet. Um, I guess we'll go into strength again. Half freeze duration would actually be nice. I think we can afford it now. Do I want to? 
want to just get some gloves with it though right now or should I wait till later? Sure. I can't use that yet. You can't use a helmet? Required level nine? The heck? For 12 fire res? Eesh. Well, the problem with big damage numbers isn't exactly just that the number is big. It's that the correlation and how it affects things ends up being a massive issue. How do you balance PvP? How do you make it so there's, you know, even just good balance across characters and how they fight and play when one character or one piece of gear changes your damage from, you know, 300 million to 20 billion? Now you have a massive discrepancy in damage right there. And that's, you know, now a big issue. Right. So that's kind of the problem, is it's not that it's just there, it's that when, when you know, you go up a single rift and now the damage has tripled, it, you know, or gone up exponentially, it just turns into silliness. You now massacre that previous boss, you know, in an instant. So. On top of it just looking silly. Yeah, a skilled player should be able to push further with worse gear than a newbie player who has the solid gear. That's, that right there is such like a critical piece to me of game design in a lot of ways it was with the RPG and stuff. If, if your skill is pointless, then it just becomes meh. Or not pointless, but you know, the terrible player with a little bit better gear just destroys you. Yeah, you might as well play Cookie Clicker then. Nice. Okay, got our uh, thanks, whiskey. Got our tower in there. Tal Eth Tier Eld. So get a row run and we're in a good spot. <laughs> Okay. 
Man, I just want to get to enchant already. It's so far away though. I... Might as well put those points in because we'll need them. I mean, it's me and Mercenary together, you know. It's a team effort. Join my army of the Are you going to get to 18 for enchant for Andariel? Um... I'll probably just... I don't know, do Andariel prior to that would be my guess. Or try get end our, get 18 after that. I mean, getting 18 in Act One is pretty rough, but we can get it in Act Two for sure. So we'll we'll just aim for that. Are there no followers in D4? They may end up having some. Chan, thank you. Join my army of the dead. You need a mercenary. Passion with only one person? It just doesn't seem right. That's right. Need a little passion. Oh. Stop it! Oh, come on! That's not fair. That is exclamation mark. Albion Online, if you want to support Llama for free, you can exclamation mark that. Download the game. Fun game. Hello. I actually do think it's a fun game. Alright, let's get, uh, yeah, get you. I'll put that to good use. We'll play a little bit later today, maybe. Good day. Uh, sword swings faster with two-handers than one-handers. Yeah, but I don't have a, I can't, I don't have enough strength yet for two-handers. Except two-handed swords. So what am I supposed to get like a two-handed spear? Bardiche Bardiches are slow though I guess you can make passion in a stab, huh? A stab. It's just melee weapons. But then I can't use a shield, which is very dangerous. Running around hell without a shield. <laughs> I'll do magic, but I feel like it'd be better to have a shield and swing a little slower, I'm not gonna lie. Might have been someone else coming, or maybe it was yours. I'm not sure which one it was. D 
don't need a shield with energy shield. I mean, the shield is just for getting all those resistances. I just want to have Ancient's Pledge or Rhyme so I can't be frozen, you know, and I can actually... Because cannot be frozen will be a huge problem. Otherwise, a staff would probably make sense, but maybe early on getting a staff. Ah, oh, nice and easy unadorned. Pretty sure you still need resistances. Okay. Get a stalagmite or something. I can't carry anymore. Let's get some good damage charms. Nice poison damage. Do it. Ow. Alright, come on, babe. I can't carry anymore. Aren't resists other than poison pointless with energy shield? Like I say, I don't I don't believe so. I believe it's still gonna be helping, right? Because the damage that you take that would go to mana would be reduced still with resistances, no? Actually, that damage comes before resistances, doesn't it? But, you still do have life. And that damage, I believe, is still going to be where you'll want the to have the resistances, so... Yeah, I don't think it's reduced when it goes to the shield, though. What happened to the house fund? I got the house. Now it's the toilet fund, the pay off the house fund. Because apparently the house didn't just cost $20,000. Like I thought. Apparently that was just the down payment. The uh, Llama RPG fund is the new fund. Good day. Nobody could have ever known. I like all these little charms we're getting here. Okay, so we have TRL as well now, so I think we're good to move forward. Any use for an artist? Thousand percent. <laughs> Readily procrastinating guy. Thanks, bear check. I mean, there's probably just gonna be a ton of art assets that we're gonna need, right? So I'll probably just throw stuff up and be like, Hey, if you want to make the intro to the, you know, Llama Land, the intro to the Swamp Zone, whatever. Draw an NPC. We'll probably just crowdsource a lot of that stuff.
When's that Kickstarter come out? When I figure out everything I need. I can pay you and lots of exposure. Awesome, thanks, Raggots. Be on mobile phones. Like I said, I actually think it will be something that will port over to mobile phones well. It's not going to be a mobile game, but I think it has, you know, kind of like a, a Pokemon ish thing where because it's turn based combat and stuff, it actually would be fun and kind of play well like that. Thanks, Bob. Mm. Nice, Michael. Before telling the rain fader to life subject to fire resistance. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So having resistances is still important for all the stuff that's done to life. What about a chemist? I don't know if we have use for a chemist. I'll let you know if we do, though. Level 12, does that open anything up to us? Does not. Honestly, maybe going back and just... Well, energy shield used to not be as good, but now it's definitely a little better. You're a train conductor, would that be useful? We can find a spot for it. I mean, the thing I do think we'll, we'll definitely need help with, or I'll, I'll need a lot of help with, and I mean, again, there's going to be a lot of things I'll probably need a lot of help with, but the one that I can think of immediately and I focus on is, like, network, setting up that stuff, server, whatever piece, just anything for multiplayer. We're, we're gonna wait to 43. So. That's my biggest concern is. How that functions. I'm sure we can find a spot for you, Alg. Uh, for throw barb recommendations. Um, it, it, it there's honestly a decent number, but you just kind of gotta find what you what you get, whatever you find with good damage and stuff on it. If there was magic here, it's long gone now. Miles is some good damage. So slow though. Oh. I wanna swing a little faster. Hmm. 
Mm, but, I mean, is it cloud infrastructure? I don't. I don't know. I don't even know what the right person is to look for for game networking stuff. You know. Bear Trek 26 gifted a tier one sub to Algvader. They have given 27 gift subs in the channel. Thanks, Bear Trek. All right, mercenary, come on. You can read. So nice. Beautiful. Why not use a long staff? Was there a long staff back there? Bear Trek 26 gifted a tier one sub to Kitty's 22. Aww, they thanks, have given Bear 28 Trek. gift subs in the channel. Project tracking, reflows, workflow. Yeah, I mean, like I say, I that is something I'm gonna need to put together. And just figure out the best way, best place to have it all. I mean, we'll probably just have Git. Just push everything there. Ouch. Move. Hey, Mr. Llama, since I subbed to you, I have found 15 burr runes in solo. And this wired guy's lesson, what should I do with all this garbage? I just sell to Charcy. Maybe you'll find some good stuff later, but, you know. Is what it is. Thanks, Nightmare. Sorry about your finds. Yeah, I've played some of those before. Moo, 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 and moo. Moo, moo. Thank you, Mercy Lago. Great, Corey, what's up? How you doing? Big damage. Aw. 15 to attack rating, 6 to energy. Kind of like that a little bit. up with a toothpick? I don't know. I was just toothpicking for a while there. Got caught in it. 
I'll put it down. <laughs> Javazon or Trapson? Trapson would be a little easier, but Javazon's a lot of fun. My attack 3 hell. E rush, thank you. Honestly, I, I don't hate the idea of going back and doing a little bit more tower. But we can also see what Beetle Burst ends up feeling like. Made to hell with your grill source? Nice. with 15 to low flare jungle. Nah. You want that teleport early? X gifted a tier one sub to Supron. It's just way too important. Thanks, Bluefin. Another one? Oh. Finding a low? GG. Now I also am thinking, hmm, I'm farming Daryl and all. No, but I could try and craft a couple things for myself early. You'll get experience there, but you don't want to be level 15. You definitely want to be at least 18. I'm RPG looking lit. Heck yeah. Feels like it's gonna be the waypoint, doesn't it? Okay, it gives us the down. Favorite bar build of only mastery and buffs. Wait, but what do how do I do damage then? I get none of no combat skill? And also, no shouting like Warcry. And a red dragon. Is it like a mercenary run then? Oh boy. Buff up you in the merce and call it good. I mean, if it's like a mercenary run and I'm just a barb who like buffs them and, and stuff, I could see that being kind of the thing he's going for. But that would still probably run a bit. <laughs> Seems pretty rough. Love. 
All right, we get it. It has binary. I feel like a lot of their qualities gone down as they've tried to improve in whatever ways, but oh my god. Come on. Greetings. Stop it, Antariel. Oh my god. Do your other attacks. Uh, okay. Join my army of the dead. I'm starting to feel I underpaid for this smiley face. I agree. The All right, dead. Has fallen. Act one done. Yay! First try! <laughs> it's okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, so... And let's get Durga. Mm, I don't know, we, we all celebrate? I mean, 6 to 11 damage is nice, but I don't really want knockback actually. Move. Move. Oh. Belt. I'll put that to good use. Okay, give that to Durga. Where are, where are you at? Sixty two strength, forty four decks. I guess let's get to this. We can make a mallet or something in that. And that'll work for now. The knockback challenge. No, we, we could make a Malice in that if if I find like an L rune and an Ith rune. I think I have a spare Eth, maybe? Yeah, Punch Barb was knocked back. Um, I could also just jam some gems in there right now and just get some damage from that, which honestly I might do. That might be the best way to handle it, is just get some basic damage right now from gems. Put that topaz, put... Actually, I might want the topaz for light res and a shield. 
I think about it. But it would be a lot of lightning damage. Yeah, so tricky. Bow pally run? I feel like I've done a bow paladin, right? Gem some jams in there, exactly. Mods, can you change my title to just say melee sorceress? Yeah, it'll be... I, I've got the, the runes, so I would just need to put them into a, a base. Any tips for a holy grail? It's gonna be long. Just enjoy it. Feel free to do multiple characters if you want, or, you know, I mean, mess around and do what you want with it. Oh my god, that fine is so ridiculous. die? What? When did he lose all his life? Is he poisoned? Homie fell over in a single hit. Didn't even see him. What up, DJ? Good to see you too, man. Yeah, hold up, let me... Perfect. When you, when you streaming, bro? Yes, I'm gonna come over and check it out. I'll put that to good use. Greetings. Seraph, thank you very much for the sub. Six o'clock Eastern? All right, swag. That's perfect, can watch you later. Ooh, that poison damage. Ooh, it hurts. Black Shaco? What? What's the Black Shaco? Woo! Durga, you, you best watch yourself here, man. What are they doing with the Shaco? Or did they just change it? Change the color? Can't see the mercenary's face. Sorry, there you go. Better? Oh, why would you ever mirror a Shaco though? Of all the things to mirror, that's what you're gonna waste it on? Just copies the item. Oh, just in people are spawning them for fun. Gotcha. Yeah, mirrors like a one in fifteen million drop or something. Something insane. 
Yeah, we haven't found any uniques yet, which is kind of sad because this character would probably be able to make use of a lot of good uniques. If Blizzard messes up Diablo 4, we trust them to ever make another good game. I mean, like I say, that's why my passion for Llama RPG came back after Immortal, really. I said, you know what? Can't trust them to make good games anymore. I'll make it myself. So that's where the inspiration came back from, really. Will there be an enigma? Yeah, I'll probably make like a trash item or something. I'm looking to make it a really fun, great game while also having fun little memes and inside jokes as well. If you want it done right, you just gotta do it yourself. Ain't that the truth? Plus zero to teleport. Yeah, exactly. And that's why Llama RPG may also port over to mobile. So we can show everybody that you can actually have fun on mobile without it being free-to-play garbage. Sweet cut, thank you. How far can you make it with melee swords before it's impossible? We're going all the way, baby! Game dev is hard. I, mean, I think it'll be hard. I don't think it's gonna be a walk in the park by any means, but. We, uh. I think it'll be fun to learn and try. And whatever piece that I have to get help from or pay someone for or whatever is just going to have to be part of it, you know. We got a budget of $99,999 before we have to pay for Unity, so...
I mean, you're not wrong. The bar for games right now feels extremely low. What? I didn't die there. Yeah, it's rough, so rough oven. Nice, Baggett. That's awesome. Congrats. <laughs> Blame Ditch Boy for this challenge. You know it's bad when my game of the year is Vampire Survivors, right? What discussion are they having? I mean, it's a great game, but man, that's the best game so far? Elden Ring was great, actually, yeah. I mean, Elden Ring is actually probably game of the year, right? But. Bear Trek 26 gifted a tier one sub to Ace Zero Swords. They have given Thanks, 29 gift subs in the channel. It's okay. 2023 game of the year? You thought it was Diablo 4. Wrong. Llama RPG! Ditch boy! Hey. Yeah. Yeah, I'm feeling bad and that I underpaid. <laughs> Guess I'll pay to play. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Ditch. Thank you, DB. Starfield? What's that one? Can you play Lomer RPG for free? Skyrim in space? That does sound fun. Yeah, I mean, we just have to wait and see, honestly. I'll have to see more info on it first. No waypoints, man. Where are they at? Yeah, monetization of of LOM RPG is not set yet. It's most likely it'll be free to play. And uh just to have like I don't know, you can buy some skins. Or, you can't buy anything, but if you support the game, you get a cute little badge in your profile. Or the game will be like five bucks or something. I need a key. Pay to win is definitely not on the table. Pay to progress, pay to any of that is not on the table at all. Just considering the step. Mm. 
Ooh, find a life. <clears throat> Again, its focus is uh, not to, to monetize heavily. Free demo, four ninety nine to get full game. Could be that. Maybe like single player is free. Multiplayer is five bucks or something. Yeah, that would be the thing. That's why I don't like skins. Because I I, I don't I don't like gatekeeping anything behind pay. So it's like, I would want it to be, you know, something where, like, anybody could get it. Oh boy. Grand Charm. Never trust free to play not to turn to pay to win. That's why I almost don't want to make it free to play. Because I don't want people to think it would be a free to play pay to win game. A signed physical copy? That's a fun idea. God, Evo. But Warframe still has skins, right? That you can buy. I mean, it is a, you know, good there. But I'm guessing there are monetized things that only money can buy. Or can you grind anything that you could purchase? Overpower classes are paywalled? Oh. Again, I'm not trying to get rich with it. I want to make a fun game. <laughs> but also have a game that at least supports its server cost or something, you know. I don't really drink coffee. Moo Girl loves coffee. Become the new Blizzard. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love that GM. <laughs> That's actually super funny.
Do I ever say swear words and not streaming? Not often. I mean, not never, but... I can't carry still generally, no. Where are you at? I need your aura to hit stuff. Oh, then no. Ditch Boy did, and I. He got a heck of a deal for it, apparently. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Yeah, I did. I did IT in school. IT major, MIS, and computer science minor. I think it's gonna be best to level on. Beetle burst. Lightning frogs. Yeah, I mean, Beetle Burst just has good damage. Unless we can go find Dark Elder. I've not read that. Interesting. I guess the idea of sentient AI is interesting as well. Part of the metaverse? Oh, no. Stay a while and listen. Where's the metaverse? Who knows? Who actually knows? Hello. The next scam trying to be pushed by the big companies or something, I don't know. Yeah, we can teleport. Just like, man. The world is tiring nowadays, you know? Every company is just a giant, awful conglomerate. Oh. No ideas, no sense of anything. Thanks, buddy. All five of them. Sorry, not trying to make it political. Just things like metaverse are so exhausting.
Just buzzwords. But you will be able to live inside of Llama RPG. Hello. MVS. Maybe next weekend we can do MVS. This weekend I'm busy, but... Can we buy a house in Lama RPG? Sure. Last MVS was the first one for you? Oh wow. Get it back at. I believe in you. Digital real estate and Llama RPG is here. Good day. Never too late. Bag up. Ooh, one to nineteen light. Lightning damage. Let's do this. Get rid of the ten mana. There's nothing the right portion can cure. <laughs> Got to save for gas. Save for gas, man. I feel you. Gas be like five dollars a gallon now, where I live. It's supposed to be cheaper in Texas. Almost over seven? Jesus. Yeah, I'm like, Moo Girl, let's not drive anywhere anymore. I think we're done driving for a bit. Will Llama RPG have mod support? I'm not gonna lie, I have absolutely no clue how to build Llama or er, uh, mod support into a game. So. I would need help from chat on that one. <laughs> I like that, Kaluku. Here, here is gonna be how the immortal boss in Lom RPG will exist. If you can find him, he'll say, ah, you found me, but can you kill me? It'll take 99 cents for you to kill me. So you pay the 99 cents if you wanna kill him. And he'll say, ah, oh, no, you've killed me, but can you kill me again? It'll take a dollar ninety nine to kill me again, and that's just gonna be the whole bus. It'll just keep going up a dollar every time. But do you want my loot? No, he doesn't drop loot. That'd make it pay to win. But maybe on the leaderboard there will be a who has defeated Immortal the most times. Boom. There you go. Join my army of the dead. 
<laughs> you should have an achievement called more money than cents that can only be purchased for $100 on the store. I like it. I like it. I just need to make sure there's disclaimers everywhere that killing him does absolutely nothing. E Rush, thank you. Did I bench my 250 today? I, I did not. Hello. I have not uh, gone to the gym today. I haven't lifted weights in a while, though. That's what we wanted, baby! Ah, oh, gorgeous. Look at that speed now. Look at that speed now. My goodness. Sorry, I was really excited. What an item. Welcome to my shop. Bam. Suck it. Level 18 opens up teleport and enchant. Gonna be a good level. I mean, Mang Song's still more exciting, but that was pretty exciting. I uh, can't give that time. I'm in trouble. I Ooh. did not yet. I need to. I, I probably would like it. I like a lot of music. Let's get 18. Greetings. <sighs> Plaid bread, thank you. Alright. <laughs> It is a melee character, but, you know, Source still has teleport. Evo? Where'd you get that music? Oops. I 
We'll definitely want to take a look later at, uh... Okay. Some stuff. Almost ace. Take a look at all the crafting recipes and see what we want to craft for ourselves later. I mean, blood gloves were a thought, but now, with blood fists, I don't know. You know? <laughs> we'll see, Louise. We'll see. Dun, dun, dun. Am I taking bids for contractors? How much exposure are you asking for? Um, yeah, no, I would definitely be, you know, like I say, it's kind of like if you are somebody who, you know, has developed games and has a lot of experience and all that and, and would want to put in a good amount of work, then, yeah, we can discuss, you know, payment for it and all that stuff. If you're somebody who just wants to, like, ah, maybe help out, you, you know, just give a little a couple thoughts here and there and stuff, then, you know, that sounds great mm -hmm. as well. I mean, I do want to make it kind of a community effort help. I think that would be great, but also... You know, I want people to contribute what they want to contribute. And then, if, you know, they're going to put in a lot of work and want to get paid for that, that makes total sense. But, again, I don't believe the, the game has a giant budget. Join my so, we just have to... If you work on Llama RPG, then Llama promises not to travel Be back in time there. to when you were a baby and capture your soul in a jar. That is a pretty good promise. Not enough mana. Well, that's strange. Mm, Not enough mana. Won't be open source? Probably not. Again. My... Development knowledge is... Not actually fit well to this. Like, I did a lot of data analytics and stuff. Um, and so, I've built a lot of dashboards and things like this, but I've never built anything like a game. I've never built stuff that is going to, you know, be multiplayer, require networking, things of that nature. Um, so, it leaves a lot of questions. A, a lot of things I, I have no experience in. Yeah, I've done plenty of stuff in Power BI and uh, Spotfire and whatever. And I was a DBA. So I have like, you know, some server, like Unix, Linux experience and stuff. I have plenty of SQL experience. Um, Python R. All of that, but. More D2 with me and Moo? I mean, we just did some yesterday. I'll put it up on YouTube if you missed it. Uh, but I don't know, whenever she wants to play, and kind of usually what it's going to come down to.
She's a cool girl. Yeah, she's pretty chill. Get him. Alright, now we're moving. Heaven. I don't know. It is an honor to serve you. A lot of plus damage stuff, which is actually nice. So quiet today. Can I have some water, Moo Girl? The camel died so no water? Come on! Thanks, Ishi. I need mana. Not enough mana. It's ridiculous. Are we going through a nightmare? No, we'll try and take it through hell. I need mana. Bloop, bloop. Not enough mana. See how it goes. I need mana. This place actually distorts reality. Fascinating. Now we did, Eva. I need mana. 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 Yeah, we are. Lovely team has made things a lot easier. It improves it for sure. Ooh. Doesn't matter, no other gloves matter now. They want Lam RPG, they just don't know it. That's what all the Diablo fans want. Oh yeah. We can put Axe 6 in it. Is this standard? What? There's nothing. The right portion can't cure. Probably somewhere in Nightmare Ditch. Are we married to the name Llama RPG? Probably. I don't know what other name it could be. Oh, single player, yes. Too deep. Llama Legends. Lord of Llamas. How are these any worse? 
Or any better. Mama lore missing. It's gonna have lore. The lore is not gonna be missing. Ouch. Son of a gun. Lightning enchant. Can you spam click through all the lore? No, I'm gonna make you sit and read the lore because the lore is good. If I'm putting time into that lore, you're gonna have to sit and listen to it, alright? Tell them how you had to listen to the lore today. What? Did you tell them how you had to listen to the lore today. Yeah. Not enough monitors. Awful. Do you want to try, try it? Did you put something special in it? Oh, grainy, yeah. <laughs> I s uh, you you made it last time. It's not bad. There's nothing the right portion can't cure. Moo. Holy, you Thank still you, find STH to make this game even more difficult Smith. laughing face. Go bikini stream to pay off her mortgage. You're gonna go do a bikini stream now? Alright, bikini stream on Moo <laughs> Girl's stream. Just kidding, just kidding. Subscriber only. Who goes there? <laughs> So there you go. Hot tub stream. <laughs> She's not an affiliate though. Yep, so nobody can see. Subscriber only, but she can't see. <laughs> I got that hit. Come on. It's weak. I can't even get a hit off. Fast Nova is allowed, yes. Good evening. I'm just too slow to hit. Greetings. I guess the thought now is do we put some points in warmth for fire damage? 
Or do we put the points into telekinesis for energy shield? Hmm. Tough choice. Nice! Now it's my hit. Let's go, baby. First try. Diablo and Gale. Because melee characters are still allowed utility. We're smacking with the staff right now. Yes. <laughs> Got a pound, dudes, with my stick. With my rod, be appropriate, ditch boy. That's like every two handed weapon, I'm or Warren. about this item. Very strange. Join my army of the dead. Thank you, Sonic. Thank you, CTA. Level 19. Installs Unity. Good. Get to work. Thank you, Calf. Hmm, that's kind of a far waypoint to look for. Go to Act 2. Shop shafts. Yeah, I will tell. Welcome. Graven Spine? Good morning. Oh, the one behind me, the Armor King Lyric. It was made for me. Mm, I can send you a link if you send me a message. <laughs> Shut up. There's nothing wrong with that, Evo. 
memory staff. Move. It might be good to honestly farm a, a memory staff. Thanks, Baron. To the shiver armor. No. Nope. And looky. Hello. I just want to enchant right now. I mean, I doubt we'll make memory, but just getting energy shield would be good. We can't really farm a memory staff, I guess, or whatever. Two to blaze. Three to blaze, three to static field, two to fireball. I mean, that's actually kind of nice if we could use fireball and blaze. Still three to static field isn't bad, but two to static field. I might just grab that one. Two to frozen armor, two to warmth. <laughs> Get a little fire damage. I was hoping you would do a melee sork at some point. No. Cool, Thanks, Llama. I was hoping you would do a melee sork at some point. Oh god, Eva, of course you will. Why did that come through twice? Weird. Garak 15, thank you very much. Gem shrine, do I have any gems I wanna upgrade? Not currently. Bam! Bam! Move. GL Legend. What up, three month? Thanks, bro. Miss you. Amen. Your repair bill on that is going to be huge. Nah. Nah, I'll be fine. It'll be all good. Switch lagging? Damn. 67 to 137 damage. I like it. It's good to see. Cool llama. I was hoping at some point you'd do a melee sword. really shoots up. Thanks. Thank you, Binary. <laughs> Evo, we should sit down tonight. Or sometime. What day is it? Thursday? It's Thursday. Good day. And 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 have a have a nice chat. Yes. Do some some prepping. Talk about life.
have the talk. <laughs> Join my army. <laughs> Cool llama. I was hoping at some point you'd do a melee sword. Gosh dang it. I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. It's not you, Evo. It's it's you. Ooh. Should just cut over. Which gives us something. A little bit of a skip. Not much though. So. Nice llama. I was hoping at some point you'd do a melee sword. This is cool llama, but I hope at some point you'll do a melee sword. <sighs> when is melee sorg? They ask as he bashes in demons with a staff. Moo! Chinovsky with ten gifted subs! Wow! Thank you so much. Does anyone know if something like melee sork is possible? Thank you so much. I I would say yes. A melee sork? Nice. I was hoping at some point you'd do that. Cool, melee sork. Yeah, I was is. hoping you would do a llama at some point. I need mana. Do a llama? Join my army of the melee sork, melee sork, melee sork. Join my army of the melee sork train. Thank you, Ditch Metal Knox, Bear Owner. Moo. Thank you, Senpai Lane with the Prime and Ibizan with the Prime. Sometime run Sork Melee, a Dugunna where you knew I Llama Hey original was I marked question. I need mana. Join my army Llama, sure on that real one, talk. How to answer Melee it. Sork meta. I mean, it's working. Technically. So. Like, you know, we've got 715 attack rating. Act 3 normal. 67 to 136 damage. Mm, it's, it's, not, it's not horrible. Yeah, we'll do this through hell. Join my army. Yeah, go with enchant. Better or worse than punch barb at this stage? Uh, better. Punch Barb nope. is a nightmare. After all this, Moo Girl's definitely gonna get Chipotle tonight. I do like to spoil her. But it's Thursday night, which is date night. You know what that means. Applebee's night! Let's go.
Yeah, it's her favorite. I always take her to Applebee's on Thursday. Applebee's brought to you by Melee Sork. It's not. She hasn't said it's her favorite, but I know she loves it. Melee Sork with not horrible damage or attack rating. Nice. Nice. So I'm saying it's not bad. You know. Excuse me, Llama. Question. Yeah. What's up? What did the sink tell the toilet? Hmm? You better you go catch it. Oh. Dang it. Get. Maybe with all these cheers, you'll even pay for dinner. Normally, she's in the past. She's always paid for date night dinner. It's kind of a tradition we've established now. I think at this point. Tradition or calculated? Well, anything that happens multiple times is now a tradition, so. Fair trick! You did a stream with her, you were paying her with exposure. That's right. Yeah, see? Fifty K bit, what? Bam, give me that chid bin. Hello. Mwah. She's really liking the game. I mean like I say, that'll be up on YouTube uh later. Maybe like tonight I'll put it up. So When, when Evo and I are sitting down to have a chat. Okay, boost up our damage a little bit. I already have a chat. Yeah, but now we're gonna have a chat. But, um. It's locked. I need mana. It's not a head, it's a skull. Yeah, that was a new girl. So particular. Old GDQ Necro speeder last night. Nice. Oh, that's so nice, Evo. Whenever it's Twitch on the credit card bill, all of a sudden you. It's just constantly your credit card is like, I think there's fraud. You're like, no, I just wanted to gift three subs. We're like, we're locking your account for five days. What? Awful. Also, now the wife doesn't have to see it. Don't tell Moo Girl. Shh. Llama and chat. Quick story. Yeah. I was at the bees, Applebee's, nice. and the waiter asked me if I want a box for our leftovers. Uh huh. I looked up and said, "No, but I'll wrestle you for it." Yes. 
cute. Oh, hey, Moo Girl. Wow, 25% deadly strike. Hold up now. I kind of want to swing this thing. I'm not going to lie. I did not know that it had deadly strike on it. Join my army of the dead. Llama, Good did you call Moo Girl White? No, I was, I was talking to, to, for you to you and... Nobody. I need mana. Oh wait. Impossible. Impossible. Why is it? Oh, here we go. It is slower. Which I don't actually like. No, I was saying for all of you guys in Canada, now Moon you girl. don't have Lama to. Llama has preemptively forgotten his wallet for date night. Well, don't go Thanks. ragging. It's ridiculous. I can't say those things. Moo girl, just don't listen to chat. You know how chat gets. They're all la 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 la, and nobody doesn't make sense. He forgot his wallet at lunch today. Shut up! Don't tell them that. I was a cheap lunch. Look, Chipotle is great. I don't know if it's a romantic date night. That's the only thing. Whereas Applebee's, it's really nice. Join my army. We here at Melee Sork you County know. have proven we know that it is better to expedite intuitively than to incubate so unintuitively. The metrics for synergies are more well understood if they are not sticky. Think nano cutting edge. Without meticulously planned communities, Power shifts are forced to become end-to-end. -end. What does the industry jargon, value added, really mean and hey llama, when is melee sork? I'm looking forward to the melee sork. Yeah. When is it? Thanks, good. Thank you, Evo. And hold up, Moo Girl just said she would pay for everything? Well, I don't know about y'all, but my wallet just disappeared forever. I think it is lost for good. Do you think most people are chilling off the fire season? Yeah, I mean, I think it naturally happens. <laughs> I did not ask that. See chat. Find you if a moo girl loves you like llama, but treat her better and put a diamond ring on it, and take her to a Michelin star restaurant. Like Applebee's. I think they have like one or two two of those stars. I don't know the exact amount, you know, but they're probably up there. Join my army. The rarest item in Llama RPG will be his wallet. Side quest, help Llama find his wallet. Impossible quest. Shatters is not bad.
That sounds right to me, Bill. The Arctic Pro Wireless. That's it. All I know is Llama RPG gets five Michelin stars. So I've heard. Uh, I mean, that is nice. No run walk hurts them a lot, though. Such a value, I know. <laughs> God, Evo. Uh, let's go this way, yeah. I need mana. Ooh, that'd be good. Okay. I mean, those are nice orb, but nothing worth anything. Just like, okay. I can't care anymore. So that gives them incentive to rate restaurants higher that are further away, so you have to drive more and burn more tire usage. Played this entire lifetime. Twenty years. No. Lack of AOE definitely hurts. <laughs> Might be better to just do. Yeah, let's just go do uh, that. Dinner time, kids' bedtime. Okay, sounds good. We'll chat later. You get the act one mercenary with exploding arrow or freezing arrow would actually not be terrible. Melee source. Let's go players three. We can try that. Not enough mana. got some games. That's awesome. Try and do some fun coverage of it. Maybe we should go to player seven. Players eight. Let's give it a shot. This is not hardcore, no. Just hope 
mercenary stays alive with it. But static will help us here to get a little bit of that damage through. Then we can start pounding some dudes. Players eight. Mm, go up there. Level goal. I mean, it probably makes sense to level to twenty four. I mean, maybe honestly, just get to the twenty five. Honestly. She has enchant, which is helpful for melee. That'd be kind of fun, but it might be too much fire. You know. Fire damage, but literally just fire sprites on the screen. I need mana. That's already like one of the hardest things for the game to handle. Destroy bit rates and everything. Yeah, I don't really want to... Hmm. Energy shield's a tough one. Because it does take a lot of points to get to it. It's almost something that'd be better to just have from something else. to three skill points just to get there. Might be good to just get close to 25 here. So then we can just go to Act 5 and not have to worry and just go from there, you know? Respect into Energy Shield at 23. Hello. Yeah, I mean, we probably want to wait till we have more mana, anyways.
Hmm. Honestly, Spirit Sword won't be bad. Just for the added damage and stuff. So still maybe making a spirit is good for normal. Socket quest. I need mana. How is static allowed? Because it's a skill still for the sorceress. Also remember, it'll only do 50% and then, or you know, 33 and then 50% damage in Nightmare in Hell, so it will slowly lose uh, its value over time. But we're doing plenty of hitting still. I do like that. Yeah, she'll go to hell. Oops. We'll make passion, but we're going to be using berserk. This is the, yeah, the part of the build where we're just trying to get to where she comes online, which isn't for a bit. <laughs> Level 24. Yes. So we could go into energy shield here soon. She still hits pretty well, I'm not gonna lie. Good day. Is this the fastest build ever? No. Is she doing okay though? Yeah. She's hanging in there. needs grief. I mean, grief is so good on her. I wish. But also it takes a while to get to grief. Hey, Sakuya, how you doing? Not here. Okay, level 24 and some chains. Let's do Travancol. No! Oh, and they're gonna heal. Mm. 
I wouldn't say static is the strongest spell in the game, just because of its fall off. Is it still amazing? Yes. But... I still think you're looking at other stuff for that. Teleport. Lightning Fury. Corpse Explosion, potentially. Smite. <laughs> Talk about a good skill. How about a skill that can just destroy all ubers and everything? No worries. Always hits. Stuns. Does crushing blow damage. Bam. Mephisto shall no longer darken Easy. our souls with hatred. I'll put that to good use. Right, we'll give it a try there, bitch boy. I do think it's a uh, something we respect into though. Not here. <laughs> I'd have to switch to a Ral Ral Helm. Eight fire res is uh, rough. Bam. Not bad. Uh, I do like the 20 poison damage though. That's my mercenary got. Honestly, all right, here's what we do. Since this has repair on it, you get this with a Rao rune. That maxes you out, and then I'll take this with my own Rao rune. I don't have one. I thought I had another Rao. Oh, I spent it on leaf. Son of a gun. Hail to you, champion. Oh well. Let's get our plus to skills. And I guess... Let's go like that. I won't be upset if you accidentally stumble across a spare RAL in your shared stash. Hey. It's all good. 
Maybe our forge will drop it. Or maybe it'll give us the Amran we want. Amran! The last three normal forges I've done have been Amran's. Can't be upset. Oh, sorry, Starbuck. Ow. What do you need? Uh, the game is showing her. Uh, I mean, I think it'd be cool. She doesn't do bad. Yeah, I think if we can go through normal today, that'd be good. Feel ya, Ace. Oh, I need to give Durga a better weapon. It's time for Pike Durga. Am I getting insight for Durga? Insight would be fantastic. What? I'll put that to good use. Greetings. She's twenty-four. No skills, sorceress run? Jesus. Sounds horrible. No. Holy three EO dolls, 35 months, what a journey. It's a lot of months. Especially if you count all of the ones that end in Y. Wait, no, that's for date. Never mind. Thank you, A. That's a far off spawn point there. Oh, that lower res, what a jerk. I mean, I'll try anything, but the crazier you get, the wilder the price gets. Ouch. Stop doing low resist on us, you jerks. I'm trying, my link. I gotta get you. Ouch. Oh, the lower res again. So nasty. Uh oh. I didn't mean to do that. Oh boy. Not enough 
Oh, yeah. This is bad. <laughs> Way too many monsters in there. Hit 25 though, which is good. I don't have enough gold. on this. When she gets swinging and isn't cold and stuff, she she's a little warrior, man. Impossible. 30 IAS. We should add more on it. Just wish it had more. <laughs> but level twenty five is here. Funny to watch Source Whack deal with the stick. I mean, I'm pretty sure I hit him four times in a row, too, which is super nice. Oh, find me some angelics, that'd be great. I'd love a grief, but. 80 to 168 damage, which is not bad. This is some player bear run. I know, no grief because I have to use Berserk. Which is super sad and unfortunate.
Can't use zeal? No, because we're using berserk. Berserk is the main hand. So. Honor is great, but again, only usable until. Get our later stuff, so. Quinn Max values one to teleport. Duress would be great if we can find an Umrin. Treachery would also be great. And then we'd have to find Lemur in there, so a lot of it just depends on what we find, you know. Um, but yeah, there is a whole, or well, there's many of them, but here's kind of like affix list. I'm expecting from Diablo 4. I'm expecting a game that visually looks amazing, but is probably a bit riddled in its cash shop with too many things that go beyond cosmetics and start mm -hmm. to get to, you know, experience boost, increase the number of items you drop, whatever stuff, right? I don't know if it'll be quite at the level of um like lost ark but I, I you know i i do fear it goes there some way um at the same time i also expect it to have maybe a little too much diablo 3 influence in it whether in the way of items in the way of combat in the way of you know dungeon building rifts all that stuff i i do worry that it'll follow too much in that path and maybe be a fun playthrough or something but ultimately not have that true longevity of a game where you go this game is so fun i just can't wait to keep playing it you know that's actually some nice damage five mana per kill cold damage easy i like that yeah sure why not you know Jaw run from Trevinkle in hell on this Sork run. Calling it now, smiley face. Might as well get more strength. Let's let's give this one a try here. Jarin. It's actually not bad damage. 103 to 195. So will it have all the like stuff that Immortal has, no. I don't think it's gonna have, you know, ridiculous monetization like that. But I do believe there's going to be some, like I say, they're gonna see how far they can push it. I think they're gonna focus very heavily on the cash shop and what all they can put into it and start to try and bend that line of what a cash shop actually is and what pay to win actually means you know i mean that's kind of my thought for a lot of these uh companies and games nowadays it feels like every time they just try and push it one step further 
And then everybody accepts it and they say, well, this is okay then. And then they just push it one step further and kind of just keep doing that. So I, I think uh, I think a lot of companies are I am trying that because they're just too too profit hungry. Hello. It's all those yeah those short term gains and everything there and uh, again it's just you know the problem with a lot of companies nowadays they've kind of lost the idea of making games that are fun just to be fun for all of that and I'm not saying it's all the devs either you know a lot of times like the devs there are kind of handcuffed by the people who pay them and so if you you know make a game that is fun and they say now make sure that there's ways that people can do XYZ and spend their money as such and you know Makes it a harder, probably. Yeah, exactly. So, I mean, you know, I think it's. They're not a hundred percent flawless in anything. But, yeah, I don't think any company wants to give you a game that you buy once and play for 20 years. Sounds like a terrible business model, doesn't it? <laughs> but that's, you know, that's what I've done with Diablo 2. I've put 30,000 hours into this game. And man, they have monetized so little of that. It's gotta be horrible. Ooh, ignore target defense with 1 to 85 lightning damage. <laughs> 18 to energy, I kinda like that as well. Might be good for hell just to have something that hits. You'd be happy with the monthly subscription as opposed to the cash grab. Well, the problem is they're not just stopping at one, you know, place anymore. Right? Like they're they're always looking for how can they get more out there because they know they can get more because look at the mobile gaming industry and how terrible free to play monetization garbage, you know, pay to win games are. So they know that there's people that will spend hundreds of thousands, if not more, on a single game. So their thought isn't, oh, let's get $20 out of this person. Their thought is, let's allow it, make ways where people can spend thousands and thousands and thousands on the game. Look at Lost Ark. The number one player on Lost Ark has spent $700,000 on it. You know, and he still doesn't think the game is pay to win. Good afternoon. Like, that's their, that's their goal. So the goal isn't sell a lot of copies to a few, you know, a lot of people and then not get a lot out. It's really just target the people that have those addictive personalities that are willing to do everything. Yeah, honestly, like, when Quinn started his little, you know, pay journey, I thought it was funny. But now, I feel like it's... I don't, I don't like it. It's gone a little too far. Now he's, like, too much actively supporting the game, you know? Do your little song and dance, spend your five grand, don't get anything, and then bounce 
But it's gone further from proving a point to now just... I don't even know what you call it at this point. I'm not sure if he's addicted, or if he just is enjoying the mess of it, whatever, but... He's unironically turned himself into a complete whale of the game. Gold, or experience here. Yeah, but like, I think we all know how crappy it is. Like, I think after a thousand dollars without getting it, we could be like, wow, this is garbage. You know, it's like, we can look at the math and see we can do math on how bad it is, like... I'm not saying he isn't right. I'm saying... Continuing to do it now is continuing to bring, you know... Success to the, to the game, continuing to promote the game more and bring viewers to the game and everything. It's doing more damage than... Or more help than damage, I would say. Do you really want Blizzard to feel it fail more? Get in, say your piece, get out, and don't give it more viewers. And then when it dies off because nobody's playing it anymore, I mean, it still probably gets played in the, you know, Easter markets, whatever, but. I have Blood Fist! Why are you doing this to me, game? I have Blood Fist! Golly. Just make those boots or something, man. Jesus. Alright, we're level 30. Seems like a good spot to move forward. Um, uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Oh yeah, look at that damage now. Bam. Those are gross. I need more. I need more. Now we are cooking. It was what? 23, 24 fire, 25 light, and 10 cold, or something like that. I mean, they were going to, they said they would do some patching still here and there with it. get that later and again it's probably like hmm at this point do I want to switch into sword and board probably I'll save you bam look at her taking on moon lords what a champ oh what a stud she is Mm -hmm. 
One to sixteen lightning damage. I do have slots up there, but I would rather put the Ral in it. Nah, it's just a random rare mask. Um, so I need a Thal rune and a four open socket there. We can make that spirit for at least a bit. So I guess it would make sense then to go spirit there. Bow necromancer? You guys have such terrible ideas. I need mana. What else do I get? Do I get my summons and stuff? Do I get to be bone or am I just purely trying to shoot a bow? Look at our damage. Say goodbye. The leaf staff really is not bad here at all. Rib cracker on? No. Just a random leaf staff. Coffee's starting to wear off, you dang coffee addicts. Still no act on fire mercy. You know that probably would be good, right? Getting the added fire damage to her exploding arrow. Honestly, probably worth at least a test. Within chance, she would actually do a lot of good damage. Ooh. Thanks, Red Eye. That decrepify is brutal. Thanks, Gemini. Woo. 
No, Durga! Oh, that was close. It's okay, he'll still die to wave three. Gotta get in there and hit them hard real fast before they drop other Hydras. Look at him go. I should have waved up on that one on a higher player count. So awful. Let's go, baby. Time to break some bail face. If you want to have it on like an offhand or something, depends your character crud. Bam! Look at that. Look at that damage. Dumped on. She hits hard, man. She is a little dumper over here. That is for sure. Hello. Good afternoon. 34 to 66, but slow attack speed. 81 ED, 14 max though, it's really nice. But I don't want to swing that slow. Sadly. Three fifty two to five hundred thirty eight damage. She is getting there, man. She is getting there. All right, we need to go back. Let's do some cows. 
Nah, you guys are great, chat. So I guess I want to find a spirit sword right now to make a... Or a, a crystal sword to make a spirit sword. This is my guess. This girl is on fire. Could also just level her up more, which I'll probably have to do later. Static definitely feels like cheating. Hey man, you're welcome to do this with the, your own rules. <laughs> you enjoy doing this non-static. <laughs> and remember, static does fall off. As you continue, so. Get to the rogue camp. I can't. Mm -mm -mm. No way, you gotta do it perfectly, Ditch Boy. Support Paladin with an Act 3 mercenary? Ugh. Terrible mercenary to pick. Not bad. Just one tap and all the cows out here. Kinda love it. We be clapping cows, man. I need more health potions for this. How's Moo Girl feel about this? She says the cows brought it on themselves. Why are they being aggressive if they if they so innocent? like that. Oh, Durga, you need to get... Thanks. There's not even any point in staticking them because I one-tap all of them, so it's like, why? Doesn't help. And I do probably still want to look at the idea of a broadsword being okay here. Or a longsword, I guess. Hell, hardcore speedrun. What character? Yeah, the speed on Longsword, and we're running the Dexterity, so that would actually be nice. So I actually do want to find a Longsword now. Sin is very different from Zahn. Zahn is torture. Sin is 
in would be like, I don't know, 150 or something. Okay, keep your eyes out. For a long sword, broad sword, or crystal sword. Maybe turn up to P3. Well, I want to make sure I'm always one tapping, I feel like. And uh. Because if not, we're just gonna get surrounded too quickly and die. And lose our mercenary and stuff, so. I, I do feel like I still need to be a little bit. Six energy, seven all res, not bad. Cautious. Come on, long sword. The first time I've ever cheered for a long sword. Crystal. I am overburdened. Oh. Move. Come on, baby. You're okay, Durga. Also, just find any long sword or broadsword a nightmare, and that would also work. However, it would be kind of nice to have it here, just like ahead of that, you know. Let's get that spirit rolling early. What's going on in chat? What are you guys doing? I'm being weird again. King murder delicious no long swords though do spike clubs however check them out I guess getting paid to watch me stream it's a good life I always recommend getting paid to watch me stream Medium murdered sounds nice. So far off. 
Ninja Squirtles. <laughs> Cute name, and thank you for the sub. would be nice. Maybe we'll get that. First to die if the cows figure out the portal. RIP Jersey. <laughs> Would you be better off with steel than spirit? I mean, steel is not bad, but Spirit has so much added damage, plus I get the plus to skills, plus I get the hit recovery, and all the added mana and life. So it kind of has a lot of extra, whereas steel is just going to be like adding a little bit for, you know, damage, but even that'll be not as much. Now strength, we could make a strength and we get the crushing blow, but again, we're missing out on all the other pieces. So it does still leave a lot of... Like it's great for a boss, other than that. But we have static, so do we need crushing blow as much? Eventually I'd say yes, but... Might do something like that, am I? I might just uh, I can't carry figure out what we'll do here, though, for a bit, and then go. Heavy booties. Honestly, not any better than what we have. Unfortunately. Man, these one shot are so nice though. Just one shotting all the cows, like this character is destroying them, and I love it. <laughs> It also might be a good place to just try and get like a mercenary base here, you know. Longsword! Ayo! Nice. Do you guys remember seeing any mercenary bases?
Oh, didn't quite make it through. Um, 55 strength required. Wow. Forgot the strength was that high. But 3 to 19 with fast attack speed. Could be very nice. And we still do need the Thor rune and all of that, so we'll figure all that stuff out. I think that's good for normal so far. Maybe do a little farming in it later, but I'd say normal is uh, pretty complete. Can cube up to Thal? Uh, almost, not quite. But yeah, it's not too hard to get there. I will probably just do some uh, norm stuff and 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 go, you know, do, do some nightmare countess. Um, all right, let me purely fast. I'll be right back. But I guess. Bye, YouTube. Don't forget to like and subscribe.